Perhaps the most imposing stumbling block to faith and the single most vexing issue to both Christian believers and non-believers alike is that of suffering. Why does an all-powerful and merciful God allow suffering? The question of suffering among those who live life on the edge, tempting fate and engaging in risky behavior is one thing. But why does God permit innocent people to endure the many trials that accompany this life? Disease, natural disasters, broken relationships, the death of a child. And perhaps even more perplexing, why is it that many people who seem to merit suffering do not experience it, while many people who seem to live upright lives do in fact suffer? Does God cause suffering or simply allow it? Does he have a purpose in it? How are we to respond? What difference will it make to have a relationship with God through the trials of life? And what does the example of Jesus, the suffering servant, hold for us? As you'll see, people of accomplishment and integrity will admit to falling well short of clear answers to these questions. But perhaps by reflecting on our own suffering, we come closer to understanding ourselves. And in seeking the truth about suffering, we come closer to understanding the character of God.